Hey everybody, we got Kevin here from Pelican. How you doing Kevin? Good to see you. Yep. Thanks for coming out. Um, so he has a few different products. Uh, Pelican is known for their cases, but they also make unbelievable lighting wipes. Um, he's got some new stuff for SHOT Show. Now this case in particular, you've probably seen for a long time. This is one of the most famous weapons cases made. But there's some really cool features that they created for this case and they're, they're releasing a SHOT Show. So let's open it up and look at it, Kevin. Yeah, this is the IM3200 made by for a Pelican Storm case. Right, and we talked about the, the different features from a, a normal Pelican case from, to Storm, and it has the uh, lat yeah, press latches. and pull latches for a locking lid, gasketed O-ring for watertight seal. They're all watertight. Yep. Watertight, yeah. you got the pressure valve. Yeah, and that allows air molecules to move in and out where water molecules can't get in. So, got it. So it prevents vacuum locks, so you can always get the lid open. Always. Now, this insert is something new, correct? Yep. Now this is this is a weapons case, a weapons bag. What this really allows you to do is get downrange, set up your your case, uh, perhaps leave it in your vehicle, open it up, and you're able to grab the bag. With shoulder strap is included and run with the bag. So this is padded. You can't see, but you can feel there's a nice padding yeah. on here to protect the weapons. You've got Molly all through here, so you can add pouches if you want different configurations. We got the scar. Yeah. And this is a two weapon design. So you can flip up this divider pad here Slide and it under. slip another weapon underneath there. So this will hold two weapons. I figure very configurable. Yeah. This allows you to take your whole weapon out of the case and be mobile. And right. this also doubles as a shooting mat when there's no weapon inside. And this is the IM3200 uh, MSRP is $430. For the whole entire kit? Yeah. Okay. Had, had it get included with the case. Nice. Yeah, it's yeah. a ballistic nylon. Ballistic yeah. nylon, okay. Yeah. It's made in the USA, correct? Of course, yeah. Yeah, made, made in the USA, and you all have a lifetime guarantee on all your cases. Yeah, anything breaks, just send it in, we'll replace it. Right, you either fix the latch, or if you can't be fixed, you replace the whole case. Yeah. Not, not much chance of that, though, because it uses all stainless steel hardware. Uh, anything coming off is pretty unlikely. Okay, so now we have some lights. You all have been making lights for a long time, and you all are known for your lighting equipment. 35 years. Yeah, yeah so talk, let's talk about the 3715. This 3715 is a right angle light. Okay. Great for first responders like firemen and EMT. Uh, when they're going into the hazardous environments, right. this has a sealed body, so it's safety approved. Safety approved uh, meaning there's no spark, explosive gas around, or right? Safe to go into hazardous environments, for example, or if there's a propane leak or something like that, they can go in without causing an explosion. Uh, it also has the downcast LEDs. Uh, this is a first for the industry, where you can see in this mode, it's just the LEDs shining. That'll offer up to 31 hours of uh, burn time. And that, and that, the downcast means you can see your feet while you're going through the smoke. And it, exactly. It gives a bigger radiant. You're heat. not going to step in any holes or fall off the edge of something. Right. Because you now have light down at, uh, where your feet are. Um, and this is the only right angle light that offers that feature. Of course, with the main light on, it has a very collimated beam, which is great for cutting through smoke, uh, but that leaves the periphery somewhat dark, so that's why we have these LEDs pointing down. Clever, very clever. Now, wh what type of battery configurations does this have? It'll come in both uh, alkaline uh, batteries as well as rechargeable. Okay, good. So you can, uh, depending on what your use is. and Yeah, anywhere from 5 hours to 31 hours, depending on whether you're in high, low, or just the downcast LED mode. It's a long time. Now, you all developed this for firefighters and rescuers, is that correct? correct? Okay. Well, this ring on the top right here oh. is a, another feature that's designed to hang. You can clip it right onto your or chest strap. Put a carabiner and put it somewhere. Yeah. And also just right on the chest uh, straps of your turnout coat. What that allows you to do is get down under the smoke, and when you bend down, oh, it the tilts. light's still pointing forward. So it's uh, very uh, user-friendly for those guys who have to get down under the smoke. Nice. So we have some of the legacy products that you guys are well known for. You have rechargeable and uh, alkaline, version. alkaline versions. Yeah. yeah, this one's the 7060. Uh, this was developed for the LAPD. Over 10,000 of them in use by the by police force. Uh, it's, it's all LED. It has cooling fins on the, on the head here. It's a true two-way switch. So when you turn this on, you can actually turn it off with the tail switch. And Pelican invented that technology as well. We're the first to do that in a flashlight. Wow. Uh, so that means that it's great for various positions, whether you want to use it for the Ferris position like so with your yes. weapon, or if you're in the FBI mode and you want to use the tail switch, there's you know, different uh, poses for depending on your use of force training. 
so it's versatile to all those applications. And so this one will run 90 minutes on high and more like two hours on low. Okay. Uh, this being uh, meant for more tactical use. We have the longer burn time in the 8060, which has a lot of the same features, uh, but much longer burn time. 90 minutes is great, uh, especially if you're able to get in your patrol car, jack it back into the recharger, and you're all set to go. So as a cigarette uh, yeah. charger? Yeah. A lot of uh, departments, what they're doing is outfitting the charger bases with 12-volt wiring harnesses that we provide right in the vehicle. So they, they have a, a cradle right on the dash. Nice. They can just lock it into that cradle. As soon as they get out of the vehicle, they're yeah. grabbing it. Right. Grabbing it. Yeah. That's the 8060 and 7060 flashlights. Well, Kevin, I appreciate you coming by and seeing us. Yeah. And um, you've got some great products and um, have a great time. Yeah. Okay.